It's your girl April, so it's time for a new wear, new amazing hair tutorial, you guys. So this one is by OMGHerHair.com. So the first time I ever did a video for them, I think it was the first time, they sent me this wig, and it was like, it was their 360, and that daggone wig, like that damn lace melted in my freaking scalp. Like, I didn't even have to do anything. I didn't even have any hair out. That's what I'm talking about, like, because there are a lot of people that don't or not or don't have the option of pulling a little bit of hair out and you know or some people just don't want to and that's fine and then there are some that purchase wigs because they look at the model on the website and they like oh I want to look like her but when they get the wig it's like I don't look like her because you get the box and you take it out the box does not mean it's gonna look like the girl on the website or the girl next door you sometimes have to wash it you gotta do a lot of things sometimes and that's just what you gotta do you know I try to make life a lot easier for me always because I don't really like to do a lot I don't want to spend all day trying to look nice this time around I do have the 360 wig okay and this is I think this is the deep curl it is virgin Brazilian curly hair and it's 180 percent density and it's a natural color you can dye it you can you can bleach it if you want to. You can do a million and one things with this. I'm going to also put a link for you guys below. The item number is the NLW03, and it's 18 inches if I didn't mention it. But when I got it, it didn't look like this. Of course, it had like the factory curls, and you want to wash it. Definitely wash it when you have a curly wig. If it just looks a lot different, the curls look more natural. So like I said, this is the 360, and it does come with the combs right here. There is one in the middle. Um, I don't really use this one, so you can either remove it if you want to. And then there's an adjustable strap in the comb and the nape. I went ahead and added some elastic. It has lace all around the perimeter like this, so you can part it anywhere you basically want to or pull it up rather i don't think you guys are going to be parting your wigs all the way back here so the only thing that i like to do to make my life easier is i like to tweeze a tiny bit of a part in it just a tiny bit um just really tiny okay now i always make a part and tweeze a little bit apart with a tweezer when the hair is wet the hair is wet the hair actually comes out of the lace much easier Make sure you have one of these good rat tail cones that are metal so you can get a good part on. You can also add yourself an extra piece of elastic, okay? That's also great because then I make it fit really snug. So I'm going to show you how I make my 360 look as natural as possible. So let's get started. So the first thing that I have already done is, as you can see, I have my own natural hair laid down in front. Now I'm going to just start out with a little bit and I'm going to place it a little bit over my hair. Now, because the glue or the glue, the gel is drying a little bit, I'm gonna take my rat tail comb and I'm gonna take like the hair up here from the wig and I'm just gonna press it down just a little bit. You can use a blow dryer if you want to make the process a little bit faster. Now, as you can see, it's laid down. So then the next thing that I like to do, this, I mean, I'm not finished yet, but you know, I will get me some concealer, something that's more or less closest to my scalp. If you can't find something that's closest to your scalp, then my suggestion would be to use the same makeup foundation that you use on your face. And you wanna take a small brush and just dab it very lightly and then you want to go ahead and smear it in. You want to take that product and smear it in. 
Now also what I find is really helpful when you're doing your lace wigs is just because you're putting concealer here doesn't mean it has to stop there. I like to kind of like camouflage it all, make you think that this is what it is. And I'll take just a little bit and I'll maybe run right here in the front, just a couple of dabs so that way it all blends in because you don't want to have just that one piece sticking out right there, that line. So you want to go ahead and kind of like dab it into, you know, certain areas where you can see the scalp. Now, their wigs are really good, so you really don't have to do too much, but yes. Now. easy and simple for you guys everybody has their own process to things to doing things but this hair is gorgeous as you can see she is so full I was saying it was deep way deep curly I think uh, some people might want to call it kinky to me it's not really kinky but it is kind of kinky because curl so this is like a tight curl okay but it's 18 inches and you definitely can put heat to it and flat iron if you want to but just keep in mind it is virgin so you can definitely bleach it if you want or dye it but but definitely check out omg her hair we all let me know what you think of my easy version is also coupon code at the end of this video or at the description box below so you can save ten dollars off of a hundred dollars but also like i said they're really affordable so if you want some affordable hair and you want to look cute then by all means check them out so yes you guys thank you for all the love and support and i will see you all in a soon to come video make sure you rate comment subscribe and i will post all of the info for you girls below